Fire accident don't kill instantly. Delayed detection does. Sis today's system wait for humans to notice, react, or press a button. And during that, de that delay, smoke raises, heat intensifies, lives are trapped, and tons of CO2 are released. That's why we created a EDIT, Emergency Detection Integrated Thermal Handler, a fully autonomous fire response system that thinks, detects, and acts faster than hu any human. EDIT eliminates delays, saves time, and stops fire using intelligent decision making, not by guesswork. Edith constantly scans the environment with four sensors, temperature, flame, smoke and motion detector. If any danger is occurred, Edith immediately cuts off the power supply to the particular area where fire has occurred. If human presence is detected uh, by the motion sensor, water is sprinkled to partially suppress the fire, allowing the human to safely evacuate. If no motion is detected by the motion sensor for 10 continuous seconds, then the Edith initializes CO2 suppressing valve. Traditional extinguishers were CO2 into the open air, but Edith does something never seen before. It captures the release CO2, filters it, and stores it back into the refill tank. The same CO2 can be reused in the future fire accidents. That means less pollution, lower cost, and a smarter, cleaner safety ecosystem. Next three weeks, we will complete the rigorous sensor testing and strengthening the accuracy. In in three months, we will integrate the CO2 filtration and recovery unit. Within three uh, within twelve months. Edith will evolve into commercial, eco-friendly, life-saving system ready for homes, malls, hospitals and etc. The real-time LCD shows the reading of flame. When kept under a flame, it reads yes. And the, as the motion is now at yes, so the Edith will spray water. If the motion is detected as no, then... As the motion is now de uh, detected as no, carbon dioxide is the action which will be initialized by the Edith.